No, no, I can't tell. White green women, come on. It's in the marble. It is surely a stone palace. No, no, sure. How high did she fly? How high? No, no, she never flew. What is sure she did? Let's so call him so going over in this old barn. And how the land is emerging. Now, Lucy, what is it? It is a providence that the thing is out now. It is a providence. What's out now? Why? Her eyes are closed. Look, you man. Why? That is strange. Our father. Your Ruth is sick. Why? I do not call it sick. The devil's touch is heavier than sick. It's death, you know. It's that driving into them. Force and hope. Oh, pray not. How does Ruth ail? She ails as she must. She did not wake this morning, but her eyes are open, and she hears not, sees not, and cannot eat. Her soul is saved in joy. They say you sent for Reverend Hill, a bell, a precaution only. He has much experience in all the money cards. He had me, and found the witch in Beverly last year, and then she remembered that. Now look at me, Quindon. I assure you, there be no witch cards here. They only found for a witch. No witch cards. No, 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 Thomas! Thomas! I pray you, leave not to witchcraft, for I doubt you, he released the whole Thomas, would wish such a disastrous charge laid upon you. Oh, leave not to witchcraft. They will haul me out of Salem for such corruption in my house. Mr. Harris, I have taken no intention in all things here, and I will continue, but I cannot think you won't laugh at this. There are her. Vengeful spirits lay hands on these children, but Thomas, you can! Tell Mr. Paris what you have done. Mr. Paris, I have laid seven unbaptized babies in the earth. Believe me, sir, you never saw more hearty babies born. And yet, each would within my arms the very night of their birth. I have spoken nothing. But my heart is clamored intimations. And now, this year, my Ruth, my only, I see her turn into me. A sacred child she has become, and shrivels like a sucking mouth were pulling on her life, too. And so, I thought to send her to your Tichibo. To Tichibo? What do you mean, knows how to speak to Good enough! It is a formidable sin to go to the dead! I take it on my soul! To the heavens, will you tell us? For Carson murdered my baby! Woman! They were murdered in the palace! <coughs> and Marcus, too! Marcus! <coughs> Last night, my youth were ever so close to that little spirit, and I know it. For how else did she stop them now? For not some power of darkness would stop her mouth! It is a moral sign, Mr. Paris. Don't you understand, sir? There is a murdering witch. Bama sleep us up in the dark. Let your enemies make of it what they will. But you, you cannot make it more. Then you are conjuring spirits last night. Sir, I said, did you my roof? Oh, Abigail. What proper payment for my charity? Now I am undone. You are not undone. Let you take hold of we put no one to touch. You have discovered witchcraft in my house. Thomas, in my house. They will talk to you of this. They will make a result. You are in the house and go see how pretty it is. Why are you here? Who is the room? My grandma, she's doing better, I think. She gave up out of the sleep before. Ah, this is such a lie. <laughs> I fear not what you put down before I brand sleep. I'm not going to let you put shit on it together. Will you leave me alone? I would wish to pray by myself. Uncle, you prayed since midnight. Why don't you? No! I have no answer for that crowd. I'll wait till Mr. Hill arrives. Mr. Barris, let you strike out against the devil, and the village will bless you for it. Come down, speak to them, pray with them. They are thirsty for your words. Surely you will pray with them. I'll leave them in a song, but let you speak nothing. Of witchcraft yet. The cause is still unknown. Mercy, you go home to the hear? My mom. If she goes for the window, cry for me at once. I will, Uncle. 
There's a terrible call in our house today. How are you sick? It's weird you're trying to talk. She seems to walk like a dead one since last night. Betty, now that Betty, stand up now. I'm I tried beating her. I gave him a good one and that should come for a minute. Yeah, let me come. No! <laughs> Thank you. 
We cannot touch it. What do you do? Ah, what do we do? Oh, I'm not. This is just raw man. Let's just sit here. What do you do? She's blackening my name in the village. She is spreading lies about me. She's a bitter cold. Snippy. Oh, what do you do? I don't want to join Fox. Who took me from my sleep and put knowledge in my heart? I never knew what grief and fear was. The lying lessons of these cursed women and their covenanted men. And now you bid me tear the light out of my eyes. I can't. I will not. You love me, John Foster. You took a sentence yet. You love me now. John, pity me. <laughs> what is it? Go.
we are. We should not be so. I'm not with them. I said my child. She learned the Tiba who murdered the sister. Goody hand. You can be child to hunger up this day. Let God blame me. Not you, Rebecca. Not you. I'll not have you blame me no more. Is it a natural work? To lose seven babies. Before they live a day. Shh. Seven years in childhood. I. What book is that? What says that? In these books, the devil stands stripped of all his rich disguises. Have no fear, man. We shall find him out if he has come among us. And I need to crush him utterly if he has shown his face. Will it hurt the child? I cannot tell. If the devil is truly in her, we may have to rip and tear her to settle the people. I think I'll go there. I am too old. Why, Rebecca? We may open the border of our trouble still. Let us talk for us. I go to God. I hope you do not mean we go to sit together. I wish I knew. Now, Mark, if the devil is here, we may witness some frightful wonders in this room. So please, to keep your wits about. Mr. Wood, stand close in case you try to fly. I'm sorry. Now, Mr. Yes. Will you sit up? I am John here, Minister of Beverly. I have come to help you. Do you remember my two little children in Beverly? How can it be the devil? Why would you choose my house to strike? We are all manner of licentious people in the village. What victory would the devil have to win his soul already back? It is the best the devil wants, and who's better than the minister himself? Betty, answer him, please, Betty! <laughs> Does someone afflict you, child? It need not be a woman, mind you, or a man. Is there a figure that bids you fly? I'll be good. What sort of dancing while you doing with her in the forest? Why come and dance with all? I think I ought to say I saw a kettle in the ground when we were dancing. Papa only soup. What sort of soup were in this kettle? Why the beans and lentils I missed your pounds. You did not notice any of the things in the kettle? A rat, a mouse, a spider? I do believe I saw some. Movement in the soup. That jumped in, we never put it in. What jumped in? Why, a little frog. A frog? And it may be your cousin is dead. Did you call the devil last night? No, I am not you, but take you up. She called the devil? I should like to speak with you. Good yeah. will you bring her up? How did she call me? I don't know, she spoke by radio. Did you feel any strangeness when she caught him? A sudden cold wind, a trembling below the ground? I never saw Betty, Betty. You cannot evade me, Abigail. Did your cousin drink any of that food in that kettle? She never drank it. Did Tituba ask me? No, sir. Did you drink it? She tried, but I refused to drink it. Why are you conceited? Have you sold yourself to Lucifer? I never sold myself. I'm a girl girl. I'm a proper girl. She made me do it. She made me do it. Abby, she me every night to go drink blood. Blood? My baby. Blood? No. She can die. Are you enlisting these children for the devil? No, no, sir. I don't tell you. 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 I don't I wait and I find myself standing in open doorways. And I'm stiff on my body. I can't tell you how many I am. I want you to wake this child. I have no problem with this child, sir. You will certainly do when you will free your from it now. I don't come back to your temple. Listen, you will confess yourself, or I will take you and rip you your death into a. This woman must be hanged. She must be taken and hanged. No, no. Don't ask me to go. I am telling you, I don't even have to go for him no more, sir. The devil? Then you saw. Now, take a look. I know that when we find ourselves to hell, it is very hard. Mr. Heaven, I, I do believe someone else bewitched you this children. I, I don't know, sir. The devil's got him new men are switching. Look, look, come. Look into my eyes. You be a good Christian woman. I said, a good Christian woman is to love these little children. Oh, no, I don't desire to have little children and love God. I love God. It's all my feet. Let me go over here. Bless me. Bless me. Bless me. Open yourself to the people. Open yourself to let God. Open your eyes. Oh, bless God. Who came to me? 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 Who came to
or a husband? Was it was it a man or a woman that came with you? Man or a woman was woman, was woman. What woman? What woman? But he was dark, black, and I couldn't see. You mean you could see him, but you couldn't see her? Well, there was always talking and running and carrying on. You mean you could see him? See him, which is I believe so. Yes, sir. Did you? You must have no fear to tell us who they are. The devil can never overcome the mystery. You know that. Yes, sir. I do. Did you? You have the best of love to the tribe, and that free foolish should come to heaven's side. God will bless you. Oh, God bless you, Mr. Hale. You are God's instrument put in our hands to discover the devil's agents among us. God will protect you. Oh, God, protect you, Tishima. how many people came with the devil? Uh, there was four. There was four. Who the names? Who the names? And four. If they think he likes the party, kill me. He said, Mr. Paris must be killed. Mr. Paris, no godly man. Mr. Paris, me, my own gentleman. And he bid me to rise out of my bed and cut your throat. But I tell you, I don't hate this man. I don't want to kill this man. But he said, You work for me, Tituba. I make you breathe. I give you pretty dress to wear. And put you high up in the sky where you go fly up to her pedals. But I tell him, you lie, no, you lie. And he come to me on my stormy night and he say, Look, I got white people belong to me. And I look, and that was good and good. So good. I stand with your husband. Are you doing it? Good young man will make white for me three times. I begged you, Thomas, did I not? I begged you not to call her. Oh, I feel her! My baby! They all struggled in her arms! Take courage, Sushma. You must have no fear to tell us who they are. Look at your God's given innocence. The devil will pray on her like a beast. God will bless you. Oh, God, protect Tichima! Oh, God, protect Tichima! Oh, God, protect Tichima! Oh, I want to open myself! I want to be like a God! I want the sweet love of Jesus! I cast the devil! I walked in his book! When I go back to Jesus, I kiss his hand! I do that for the devil! I do the old for the devil! I do the big show for the devil! I do the difference for the devil! I do the old for the devil! Sure. 
And so I was about to just happen and must be true. Only of them, says he. What God to remember that this girl must fall to see after turning you away. And then she replies, Why are you absent? No cats at all. I only say my command. I hope I only say my command, says she. And that's a surprise. And the turkey says, Sign for us your command. And all the time she could not say a single word. She never knew no command. How can I not fly? <laughs> oh, when well, they mustn't shake her herself. I told you the broken heart and the heart is from the judge said. You look so disappointed. I must tell you, sir, I'll be gone every day now. I am amazed you do not see what great teamwork we do. What great teamwork you do? It's a strange world to be the Christian girl. But, Mr. Proctor, there will not time that we may confess. Sir Gordon only is sitting jealous sometimes. Oh, 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 and it is a wonder for you. Stay from this. Goody, good is pregnant. Pregnant? I mean, my little boy is Oh, they have not took away the sound of my anxious thoughts with me. That you say, thank God, for the not have to stay with your child. So, I'll be gone every day now because I'm, I'm an official of the court. They say I'm not going to be outside with me and they go to the office. You say that I'm going to do me and say, young Mr. Proctor, we must discover where he's hiding for who to take her life today. What? Oh, what? I hope, sir, 
seeds of it's a needle. Why? What's the meaning? The girl. The Williams girl. Abigail Williams. She sat to dinner at Reverend Parrish's house tonight, and without the word of no morning, she falls to the floor, like a struck beast, he says, and screams a scream that a bull weep to hear. And he goes to sit and stuck two inches in the flesh of her belly. She drove a needle out. And how the money with her, how she found to be so stuck, she claimed it was no vice for me and spirit that what she did. What she has done with herself, I hope you are not taking so proof this time. Tis not proof. I find here a pulpit pretty cotton. I found it, sir. And in the belly of the pulpit, a needle stuck. I said, you know, no, no. Come here. Help this woman come to my house. What oh, 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 May it be perhaps that some unconscious you feel enough to say this? Conscious me? Who oh, I know, sir. I am retired myself. I see. And let your asses down the walk on. She's always so easy to court. Oh, that's an asker. I was so decided to wasn't me. Bring the guns with him. Don't let me show you something. What? Bring the guns. You know, Mary Ward, you shall have a court and poor bird on that. Mother, I don't know what I will do for a start tonight. A needle of the mouth. It charges me. Ah. If a woman's murdered, she should be ripped out of this world. Ripped out of this world. Eric, you heard it. Out of you. Mother, you better get out of my house. Out of you. You bring me out of your house. Out of my house. Now, go for it. Get your body back. You are a broken minister. Broken minister. If she is innocent. If she is innocent. Why does your mother ever wonder if I would be innocent? Or Mrs. Paris? Vengeance is what you say. And we are what you call this word here. That word, that word is vengeance. And I will not give my life to vengeance. I think I was going to. I have married an outside job. You can keep it. Will you see her taken? Doctor, the court is just. But it's violence. God will not let you wash your hands of this. I think I'll go, John. I'll bring you home. I'll bring you soon. Oh, don't bring me home soon. Be I will not fear anything. You will not take her Tell her, hold her hand, Jen. Harry, hold her hand, Jen. Hold her hand, hold her hand. Child, child, child. What I have heard in your favor, I will not fear to testify before. You are a cow. But you will be in God's own tears. You are a cow. So, what then, mother, down the hands, for the men of God's delight? I pray God, open up our eyes. I never heard you by the best sailor. Lily, Francis. Lily. John, tell me we are lost. We command you. All right, sir. Go home. I'll speak to you tomorrow. Good night. Good night, sir. Good night, Francis. Oh, Mr. Proctor, very likely that let her come home once they've given proper evidence. You come to the court with the word. I cannot tell the mother of Abigail! You tell the court of this woman comes to my house oh. and you start on it. Oh, she will kill me for saying that! I've been just lecturing you, Mr. Proctor! She stole you. I have known it, sir. She will bring you with it. I know she will. Good. How soon has it done? The world is likely to open it today. You told the question of who you know. No, I did not tell me! My wife is never the kind of thing. I'll be your own wife since you don't allow. Without being less, without that. No, 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 Mr. Potter, I did not take it. Let me go with you, No, I did not.
or to say to the boy, go do it, that is your rock. This very morning's conversation, on the past few months, what you read, until two weeks ago, she was just like every other child in this day. You heard her scream. She howled. She even swore to me the spirit is a joke. She even texted her all things. Alright, sir. She swears that she loves her own spirits. Don't say it. And she declares her friends are lying. Excellent. I'm on it. I think this coach is a lot of the matter. Indeed, it surely does. I didn't sign 72 in the death I'm a minister of the Lord. And I dare not take a life without him. Mr. A, you surely do not doubt my justice. I have this morning signed a way to sort of a nurse or one. I may shut my conscience to it. My hand shall get it with the Lord. Mr. Hale, believe me, for a man of such terrible learning, you are most evil. I hope you will forgive me, but we must rely upon the victims to testify, and the children certainly do testify. Therefore, what is left for a lawyer to bring out? I think I've made my point, have I not? But this child claims that they're not true. And that is precisely what I'm about to consider, sir. What more may you ask of Unless you doubt the property. I surely do not, sir. Let us Let you put your heart to rest. And let us just I should not be silent. I bid you be silent. <laughs> Mr. Chief, will you come into the court to bring the children out? I see. Mary Warren, how came you to this pair of us? Has Mr. Proctor threatened you? No, sir. Has he ever threatened you? No, sir. Has he threatened you? <laughs> no, sir. Then you mean to tell me that you sat in my court carelessly lying when you knew that people would have by your evidence? Answer me! I, I did, sir. How were you instructed in your life? Do you not know that God damns all lives? Or is it now? <laughs> no, sir. I am with God now. You are with God now. I, I, sir. I will tell you this. You are either lying now or you are lying in and in either case, you have committed perjury. You cannot lie, you said you lied, Mary. Do you understand that? I cannot lie no more. I am with God now. I am with God. You would find the blood in the court, sir. No idea the children. These will be sufficient. Sit you down. Mary Warren has given us a deposition in which she swears she never saw any manifest of the devil. Now, it does not escape me that this may be the vice of blindness, and if so, her neck will break for it. But if she speaks the truth, I bid you now, children, drop your guide and confess for quick confession for easy. I'll give you a witness. Right. Is there any truth to this? It is a lie, sir. Children, do you change your position now or do you force me to hard question? I have not to change, she lies. You would still go on with this. Aye, sir. A woman was discovered in Mr. Fox's house with a needle. Mary Warren claimed that two sat beside her in the court and witnessed as how she herself stuck the needle into it with safety. What say you to that? It's a lie, sir. While you worked in Mr. Proctor's house, did you ever see any problems? Queen Proctor always kept problems. No one knew. My wife had not kept some problems. The rest of the people, when I sat with Queen Proctor in that house, she said she never kept her problems, but she said she did keep problems when she was a girl. She has not been a girl these 50 years ago. But the problem is, it's in here, but now it's a kid. Except, maybe one swear she had some of the problems in my house. No problems. Why could there not have been puppets kept to her? No one would have fired. There might also be a drunk with five heads in my house, but no one has ever seen it. <laughs> we are here, Your Excellency, precisely to discover what no one has ever seen. What has puppet this girl to turn us on the box? What is the main one in here? You were charging Abigail Williams with a marvelous food block to murder. Do you understand? Right, that? sir. I believe she needs murder. This child is murder, 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 child. Not you. In such a congregation, she is twice here with the two thousand meetings. So that's good. What does that matter? Your Excellency, she wanted the teacher was power at the time, but she is so I, she's so annoyed, goes to land. Quiet! 
Sure, you have no word on the question. King John is contemplating a word. Ah, continue. Mary, so the deputy governor had to dance to your feet. John, all I can say is since I keep you saying that this man's blood. In a moment, sir, what is this dancing? I am the proctor. How can you use the person to do this? But then, that's the name. Your man, this is me, so much. So the piece of the dead man. This is a challenge! Yes. Mr. Pyrus! Yes. All I can say is I have also any of them making But you must cover them dancing in the woods. And they are the peasants. When I first arrived with them, Mr. Pyrus told me that you denied Mr. Pyrus. I do not, sir, but I have also. But you saw them dancing? I saw. <laughs> Excellent. Bring you to me. Pray, proceed. You? Say you saw no puppets, Mary. You are never threatened or afflicted by any man that of a devil or his agents. No, sir. And yet, when people accused you of witchery, you would beg, say, no spirits came up from your door. I cannot hear you pretend, sir. But you did turn cold, did you not? I myself picked you up many times. And your skin was well, I see. Mr. I saw that many times. Show you the spirits. The old man is spirits. Then, can she pretend to bed now? <laughs> no. Why not? For now, there are no afflicting spirits in this room, as none are accused of witchcraft. So, let her turn herself cold now. Let her pretend she's attacked now. Let her faint. Faint! Wait. I proved just how you pretended in the court so many times. I cannot face now, sir. Can you not pretend it? I have no sense of it now. Why? What is lacking now? I cannot sell. Could it be that here we have no afflicted spirits loose, but in the courts there were some? And there were some no spirits. Then see no spirits now. And prove to us that you can face by your own will as you claim. No, I Then you confess. You talk to the these spirits, Major Fritz. No, sir. Your Excellency, this is a trick to blind the court. It's not a trick. I used to be because I thought I could thought you saw them. But I did not, Your Honor. How could you think you saw them unless you saw them? I cannot tell how, but I did. I have that girl screaming, and you, you know I can see to religious. And I, it was only sports in the beginning. But then the whole world cried, Spirit, Spirit. And I, I promise you, Mr. Dad, but I only thought I saw them, but, but I did not. Surely, your excellency is taken by this, this simple lie. I okay. I forbid you now. Search your heart and tell me this. Is it possible, child, that the spirits you saw were illusion only? What is this? This is a base question, sir. Child, I have been mean, hurt, Mr. Danforth. I have seen my blood running out all because I done my duty pointing out the devil's people. And this is my boy. Do be mistrusted. Question like that. Sorry, I do not mistrust. Let you beware, Mr. Daphne. Think you to be so mighty that the power that will not have your wits. Beware of it. There is.
find some evil in you that you might know me. But man will not cast away his good name. You surely know that. In what time? In what place? In the proper place. For my beast. On the last night of my joy, some lady from France. She used to serve me in my house, sir. A man may think God sleeps. God sees everything. I know you. I beg you, sir. I beg you. See her for what she is. My wife, my dear good wife, took her soon after and put her out of her room. And be what she is, a love of vanity. Your Excellency, forgive me. Forgive me. But she thinks to dance me on my wife's grave. I know she might, for I thought of her so softly. God help me. I am lost, and there is promise in such sweat. But these are horse and you will not see it. I see myself entirely in your hands. I need to see you. You deny every scrap and tittle of this. If I was after, I would leave and I would not return. I have made a bed of my own. I come with you of my good name. You believe in this stuff. My heart is innocent. Except you were whole soul. <laughs> what look do you get? I will not have such a You will remain where you are. Mr. Paris, go into the court and bring the white proctor out. You are bring her out! And that is not one word of what's been spoken here. Now, we shall get to the bottom of this swamp. Your wife, I say, is an honest woman. In her life, sir, she has never lied. And if I cannot sing, if I cannot weep, my wife cannot lie. And when she put this girl out of your house, she put her out for all of I sir. And knew her for all of I sir. She knew her for all of Good. And if she tell me, child, you were for all of may God spread his mercy on you. Paul, turn your back. Turn your back. Do like what? Now let neither of you turn to face me, Proctor. No one in this court is to raise a gesture, I or nay. Enter. Listen to Jesus. Report this testimony in all exactness. Where is that? So come here. Will you look in my eyes and my eyes only? Good sir. We are given to understand that at one point you dismissed your servants. Abigail Williams? That is true, sir. What cause did you dismiss her? You would look at me, woman. Was she slowly, lazy? What disturbance did she cause? She dissatisfied me. In what way dissatisfied you? She was. Your Honor, I think that time I was sick, and I. My husband is a good and righteous man. He's never drunk his seven hour, no wasting his time on the shovel for but to always at his work. But in my secret, you see, sir, I was long time single to my last baby. And I thought I saw my husband somewhat turning from me. And this girl! Look at me, I sir, I'm here But oh, I'm here Williams. I came to think he fancied her. And so one night I lost my wits, I think, put her out on the highway. And your husband, did he indeed? Turn from you. My husband is a good man, sir. Then he did not turn from you. He is Look at me, woman. To your knowledge, is John Proctor a lecher? Is your husband a lecher? No, sir. Remove her, Marshall. Oh, yes, he has spoken. Remove her. Oh, no, boy. No, boy. No, boy. She only wants to see her. Her husband is a natural man. I beg you, stop now and call her. She has spoken. This man has lied. I believe him. From the very start, she's this girl that's always struggling. You know it! Come here! 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 Come here!
This will be the third night. She tells me she will stay at night. Must see Lewis. And the next day, when she does not return, I go to Mr. Lewis to inquire. He tells me Mercy will spend the night in my house. Hey, I saw. What? Why would he be outside the party? I believe, I believe they'd be aboard a ship. My daughter had been speaking of ships last week. At the time, the day they discovered my shop box is broken. She has got you, thought she was found with God. A little penniless. Mr. Paris, you are a brainless man. Excellency, it profits nothing. Should you blame me? I would not think they would run except for fear for being kept in Salem any longer. Mark it, sir. I begin to have close knowledge of the tower. But I fear. I fear the riots. Right? Why I ever think you shall see not, but I pray that I flash in the town. That's why the human soul can have to now. Pray, how do you propose to I propose. I propose that we postpone this. There will be no postponements. Give me the list. Excellent. Now, sir, which of these may be brought to God? I will strive with them myself to God. Excellent. There is no time. I shall do my utmost. Now, which of them do you have postponed? Excellent. A What do you say? Tonight, when I open my door to leave my heart, I dug a cutter to the ground. You cannot have this sort. There is danger for me. I dare not leave my house at night. Accept my congratulations, Reverend Hale. We are glad to see you return to your good work. You must follow me. It will not watch. Now hear me. Twelve are already excellent. And the names of the seven have been given out. And the men are waiting to see them die this morning. Now draw yourselves up like a man and pass me as your vows to do so by heaven. Have you spoken with them all, Mr. Hale? All of us frogs in the end of the day. What is Proctor's way now? Well, he sits like some great man. He does not know who lives, except he will take food from time to time. His wife? His wife must be well on with the child. She is, sir. You have close of knowledge of the man, Mr. Harris. What is he? My, his wife's presence softened him? This is what's up, sir. He has not been like him at least three months. I should suffer that one. Is he yet at me? Has he struck with you again? He can. He's changed in the world. Listen, then it should be called Then it should be called I see. Why have you returned there? You baffled me, sir. There is blood on my head. Can you not see the blood on my head? Hush, someone's coming.
No. Did you ever see her sister Mary Easley with a double? No, I did not. Did you ever see Martha Corey with a double? No, I did not. Did you ever see anyone with a double? I did not. Has anyone ever? I speak my own sins. I cannot judge a woman. I am not talking. Excellent. It is enough to confess it. Let him suffer. Let him sign it. It is a weighty name. It will strike the village that comes to confess. The sun is up. Excellency, I beg of you, let him sign it. Come then, sign your testimony. You have all witnessed it. It is enough. You will not sign it. You have all witnessed it. Do you support with me? You will sign it or it is your confession, sir.